All right, your section seven of uh, the dash GE dash seven model train section seven instruction compressor air equipment introduction air compressor for the Gardner Denver the type of the DWB O W B G description inspection lubrication intercooler orifice test repairing compressor on local mode of the data and troubleshooting. Introduction. The section cover the garden and demo the type of the WBO and the WBG air compressor for the air compressor during the normal local mode of operation. Apply high pressure as near air needed to the air brake system. The air compressor for the garden and type of the WBO of WBG. The description. Instruction apply for the three and six element of the two stage for the water cooled air compressor. The low pressure cylinder with their mounted on each angle of the, each of the side of the machine. The high pressure cylinders are mounted vertically same over the machine. One air suction valve and one discharge valve are located on the head over the each of the cylinder bore. The water cooler and inter intercooler. Water cooled intercooler is provided with the cool air into the air of the path of the Low pressure for the high pressure cylinder figure um, 7 1. Inspection and lubrication oil, uh, general oil level of the crankcase must be maintained in run of the dome but on the oil level of the gauge and additional is required to maintain the correct level. Figure 17, 7 figure seven one garden endeavor air compressor type of the type shown under the assembly. Quick release fastener discharge valve, air suction valve, low pressure cylinder, air lit inlet filter, high pressure cylinder, low pressure cylinder. Oil pressure should be uh, should be set with between 18 to 20 psi gauge engine idle with 445. 450 RPM with the compressor loop oil with 140 um, degrees Fahrenheit oil with the pressure with control with the oil relief mount with the side of the crankcase and, and at the intercooler end inter cooler end the figure 72 oil with the pressure adjusting with the adding of the roof of the shims beneath the pressure adjusting cap of the oil relief valve with the adding of the shims reduce the pressure of the early cleaning the crankcase each time the oil of the chains jerk slug if any of the crankcase will be picked up in by the pump, if allowed to accumulate with the vent lead plug with the pump section, thereby lubricating the be structure the possible damage if it's moving the part with the main result. All right, figure 7-2 shows the oil relief valve assembly. Figure 1 is the cap. Figure 2 is your pressure adjusting shim. 3 is your spring. 4 is your relief valve. 5 is your um, valve housing. 6 is your pipe plug. 7 is your your screw and uh, eight is your gasket caution explosion inside of the machine can occur with the gasoline with the kerosene you for the cleaning of the crankcase you for the regular finishing or flushing oil wiping out of the crankcase for the cleaning the in the line linen lint, lint free cloth the intercooler drain the kind of condensate with the intercooler through the drain valve at the bottom of the shell operate with the intercooler safety valve to be sure that the function is properly note that the intercooler gauge pressure for the wind provided with the compressor compressor is now operating with the normal the operating pressure should be approximately 40 psi gauge from the wb and 35 psi gauge from the wbg safety valve you for the both the machine with this used step with the 65 psi gauge to affect the high pressure suction of the wind or valve the, um, may cover the safety valve with a pit pop continuously check the safety valve with the correct opening pressure if um, popping the precision with the refer to table of 7 2 with the correct application or for the test of the per dot regulation. On local mode, you for the accurate air gave the orifice over the orifice board with through one sixteenth of the inch thick plate. Leave the edge square of the table seven one with the plate for the orifice plate gave and drain cackle the reserve fires from the or uh, compressor. Refer to figure table seven one for the correct orifice from the compressor only unit in the normal temperature or indication. Our right, table seven one show the orifice reserve pressure for the PSI gauge at the various altitudes. Um, new repair compressor and condemning limit of the RPM zero from zero one thousand two um uh, RPM zero one thousand two thousand three thousand four thousand five thousand six thousand seven hundred and eight thousand. The WB in oh seven seven uh, seven seven eighth of an inch five and three quarters by five and inch three cylinder US orifice zero point two eight one two five nine thirty two thirty two of an inch or one sixteenth inch plate. The WBG seven inches and five three quarters of an inch by Five in six cylinder U.S. orifice zero point three five nine or twenty three sixty four twenty three sixty fours inches with one sixteenth of an inch plate. Open the reserve drain valve um, cock within which for the orifice and install the board. The, run the compressor for the two minutes. Then take the record of the speed pressure for the reading with a point for the chart table of seven one with the reading and the compressor for the fifteen minutes. Then repeat step four. Compare with the speed pressure for readings with the data in table seven one with the points fall below the condemning limit of the curve of the move of the overall of the compressor repairing the compressor and locomotive. The general repair for the necessary repair of the compressor without removing the from the locomotive. The possible excess of the air of the sure and the cleaning cleanliness when any of the parts is removed from the compressor when or if the test for the compressor and indicate for the actual delivery of the Air below the required minimum of the condition of the traceable defective valve, the worn piston rings, the worn cylinder, the valve should be examined. If necessary, replaced with the heavy carbon formation for the present of the round, the valve, the heads should be removed. 
through cleaning and surgical process, the sale of the fall failed to meet the requirements for the orifice test. The cylinder piston should be removed. When the cylinder piston is removed, the crankcase oil should be drained, and the crankcase cleaned and washed with improved with the solvent to remove all the sludge and deposits. Warning: Solvents may be toxic flammable when caused harmful, fatal injury only with the adequate ventilation contact with the skin and insulation with the fumes. Do not expose the flame with the spark after the compressor is completely reassembled before the resealed and surface um, released and surface of the field. The crankcase at the proper level recommending lubricating oil. The cylinder and piston removed, with the remove, removed from the compressor should be reconditioned for the use of the ring, ring removal. The necessary for the old ring should be discovered. The replace of the new ones. The install of the rings that installed with the, with the minimum possibility of the damage of ring the insulation tool should be used with an alternate view for the narrow strip of the metal bridge, bridge with the vacant ring grooves. Figure eleven, um, figure seven, three, um, proper position, piston ring arrangement. The um, show that the high piston ring, um, high piston, uh, high, high point of piston rings, low point piston ring, cylinder bores, um, compression ring, side seal, um, side seal spring, top of the ring, compression rings, oil control ring, oil control ring. Make sure these identification marks on the cast iron ring is top of the um, top of the piston. When applying the rings, the taper face of the rings may be installed with scraping the edge around the force of the oil towards the crankshaft. The um, side goes up, goes up. That can be identified with a special mark of the word top. Do not apply the three face ring, for they also slow the seating. Um, seating of the do not control the oil carry over there as, as well with the original equipped with the taper face type. No compression rings are marked on the top of the identification mark to ensure the proper al application. The figure seven three with the oil control rings are, are not marked as they may be applied with the either side up. On um, lower pressure position of the compression ring with the side seal of the springs are applied with the first top two groove, the third groove is left open and the side seal of the spring is always above the ring. Oil control rings are always given at the bottom of the groove of the piston. Note that for the air compressor shift alignment that refer to the mechanical section with the composite oil pump plunger type. The oil pump should not um, should fit the crankshaft to limit the list for the dab of the section. The Clearance the limits of the exceed with an oil oil pump. The eccentric will be required. The plunger type of the oil should be inspected for the scoring and except for the wear of the clearance of the limit of the given them with the dash section. The new pump symbols should be installed. Figure 7 4 show the near gear type loop pump with starting with a WB. G nine fifty nine fifty five ten WB nine five sixteen. Oil drive gear, oil pump, body oil pump, screen connection um, to the body pump and the screen. All right, your gear type figures, um, seven figures, um, seven four and seven five. Uh, the condition of the pump is be determined by, um, best by the removal of the head plate, check with the internal pump with the successful wear, the end of the clearance of the addition, remove the plastic gear, um, gasket for the pump shaft that can be rotated freely with by the hand. The loop pump with the drive and shaft end plate should be between one thousand, one thousand, four thousand of an inch. Push tape with the roll bearing with tape at the end of the shaft up, adjusting it until the end shaft and play within the limit to adjust the and advanced adjusting to the net locks locking position. Screw the Locking washer and refer to figure seven, seven six for the internal clearance. All right, seven. Um, you, sorry, lube oil filter. The two, the two a take a oil pressure reading of the two tapes opening for the side of the oil relief valve. With the, when the difference of the fourteen psi gauge for the two reading for the reach for the engine idle at four hundred fifty RPMs, replace the filter. Oil pressure relief. The oil pressure relief valve should be completely disassembled through the cleanly and inspected. The all passes should be blown out and used with compressing air. The valve should be reassembled, reset after the uh, installation with the compressor. All right, you can have the driver in your oil pump in the sea shaft. The orifice, the orifice plug for the drive in must be turned so, um, so flat inside with the head drilled with the hole and pointed away from the center line of the shaft. Uh, the center of the shaft. No, the drawing applied with the compressor mount the plunger pumps. All right, you got to drive in your center shaft orifice oil pump in with the orifice plug for the end of the must be turned so flat that the so the side end of the head of the drill with the holes are pointed away from the center line. Orifice plug with the oil pump must be turned so flat that the of the drill holes are pointed toward the center of the light line center shaft. Note the drawing applies only with the compressor mount with the gear driven mount. Warning when the oil, when you the compressor air for the cleaning with the purpose of the environmental potential hazard of the personnel immediately air for the creative to prevent and physical injury with the flying debris. Observe all railroad OSHA safety regulations. All right, and then you have in Figure Six, um, Figure Six, Figure Seven, Six of the gear type loop oil inter, inter, internal clearances. You have two th two tens of an two thousand of an inch rotor casing, casing and two thousand of an inch feeler gauge clearance between the rotor and casing. Two thousand of an inch um, idler and idler bushing, idler pin feeler gauge clearance between the idler pin and idler bushing, idler head head uh, head crescent and feeler gauge clearance between the idler crescent and the rotor casing, idler head. All dimensions, inches, and clearance between the rotor and casing and Adler head and intercooler should be removed with the compressor overhaul of the cleaning inside and out. Accumulated with oil with the residue should be removed with the age air passage and assume that uh, ensure the maximum efficiency back plate should be disassembled to clean cooling water passage to ensure the full, full coolant flow of the passage will become plugged in long surface operation. 
Or your crankcase capacity in gallons. The WB series is 10.5. WBG series, small crankcase, 3.5. So WBG series, large crankcase, 17.5. Your clearance is an inch, low pressure cylinder, oil control, ring gap minimum 8,000 inch, low pressure cylinder, piston cylinder minimum 35 to 10,000 inch, high pressure cylinder, oil control, ring gap 6,000 of an inch, high pressure cylinder, piston cylinder minimum 3,000 of an inch, connection rod bearing, ring to crank pin, die parameter, clearance of an inch 12 to 10,000 of an inch, um, connection rod sign, clearance, total free rod minimum 13,000, thousandths. Um, pin, assistant pin push and clearance minimum 1000s. Oil pump eccentric crankshaft minimum 1000s. Maximum 3000s. Oil pump plunger to oil pump body clearance 1000s. Minimum 3000s. Maximum bearing cleans and clearance cold. A, um, WBO 8000s to 10000s and um, WB 10000s to 12000s. Trouble shooting. Intercooler important part of the compressor should receive the special attention during the inspection maintenance for the two stage compressor for the air drum with the cylinder with the low pressure stage for the heat of the compression force into the intercooler as pressure for the approximately 35 to 45 pounds. The intercooler removes the large portion of the heat between before the air enters the high pressure stage. Whenever necessary, determine the faulty beginning with the checking at the intercooler table 77. Star asterisk means current units have, units have cage rolled bearings and high pressure pistons. All right, considerable time can be saved using the following procedure for locating the defective vise. Remove the pipe plug with the intercooling appliance 0 to 75 psi air gauge to the intercooling pressure for the abnormally high only when the pumping can inspect with the high pressure function and discharge valve. Um, if the intercooling pressure inclu- increases slowly when they unload it with the check, the high pressure discharge valve with the high pressure inspection unloading mechanism. If the cooler inc- intercooler pressure is abnormally when the pumping can drop to zero pressure is less than three minutes when unloaded, low pressure discharge valve should be inspected. If the intercooler pressure is abnormally low with the pump, pumping with the pump bottom drop with a few pounds with the after being unloaded with the three minutes low pressure suction valve to be inspected. If the, it has been determined that the trouble is in the low pressure stage of the particular valve, the, the fault is usually have the weak and erratic sound, sound suction sound, abnormal blowback with the air filter when pumping in excess of the hot discharge valve cover plate. And then it goes into the notes, and then you have a troubleshooting sh- um, side. Um. And this was your compressed air equipment in section 7 dash g dash mile 7 series.